I don't necessarily aspire to be some famous superstar, but I aspire to be legendary. Welcome back to my channel. I'm really excited because I have one of my dear close friends here with me. I call her Yolanda, but <laughs> she goes by Yo Yo Nosa. And she's here today because she's opening for Fallapalooza. I'll be doing So Good, okay. Dio Thing, which is dropping um, off of the Honeymoon EP. Okay. And uh, Trust You. Yay, my favorite. <laughs> So I guess to jump right into it, one of the first things that I noticed about you, it said some of your inspirations were Etta James. Mm -hmm. Etta James, Michael Jackson, Amy Winehouse. That's who I was thinking of, Amy Winehouse. I'd say of the new, newer generation, um, I'm really liking Ari Lennox, Raven Lene, um, Brett Fiaz. So out of all your inspirations, uh, dead or alive, um, which one would you absolutely have to meet? If I could bring somebody back from the dead, it would definitely be Etta James. I remember um, singing at last on stage. Uh, I was like, I think at this time I was like seven years old and it was during the play and I got a standing ovation. And I was bullied a lot during elementary school. So that moment for me kind of um, gave me a new level of confidence that I didn't have as a kid. And I really resonated with um, that moment and the story behind Etta's music. Uh, like I said, I was a little kid at the time, so I couldn't really understand all of the things that she'd gone through in her life. But the more I had studied her as I grew older, I learned that as a singer-songwriter, um, a lot of her songs came from the experiences that she went through in her love life. And that really like hit me deep, you know, and I wanted to be able to make music the way that Etta did. I don't necessarily aspire to be some famous superstar, but I aspire to be legendary and make music that is timeless the way that Etta did. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can we hear a little at last right now? Are you, yes. are you, <laughs> oh, we can yes, hear we it. Yes, we can. All right. Let me just clear my throat though. <clears throat> and then straight to the camera, we are gonna hear some. <laughs> the whole I want to be legendary I think the only way in order for you to become a legend is by studying the legends studying what it is about you know Etta James Michael Jackson Prince like what it elements about them is it that makes them legendary and for me um, I try to incorporate many elements of female empowerment and embracing your sexuality as a female because we don't really see that in um, a lot of music. A lot of um, soul music that is performed by women is usually on the more like subtle side, like subtly sensual. And I mean, that's cool. But um, as an, a neo soul artist, I want to be able to incorporate all of those soulful elements, but add a little new flavor on it. It's about to be 2020, y'all. Like. If we're not going to talk about sex, what are we going to talk about? Period. Period. So just to like, for people who may have missed it, mm -hmm. your style of R&B, or sorry, it's not R&B, your style of soul yes. is called Neo Soul. Yes. I love it. I so. have a question. Do you believe in manifesting things? Oh, yes. Have you mm -hmm. seen some of the things you manifest? Um, have you seen them come to light? Yes. Can you share? So before the school year, this is this is one of the Fallapalooza. Ah! Like, 
before the school year even started, I, I was telling people, I was like, I'm going to open this year for Fall of Police. And they're like, okay, Yolanda. <laughs> All right, you do that. We were in for you. I'm like, no, I am going to open this year. And um, that's another thing that, like I said, my mom's very influential in my life. And when I was little, she used to tell me, like, stop saying, oh, I hope or I wish. She said, just, just say it. Just say it like it is. Say it the way that you want it to happen, and it will be yours. You have to be able to claim things for yourself. Oh, and don't feel guilty about it. Claim it for yourself, because that's the only way that you're going to get it. You have to, if you don't believe in yourself, who else is going to believe in you? So, <laughs> new music. Can we, can you tell us yes. what's happening? Yeah, so it's called Honeymoon. It's a play on words, like, you know, Honeymoon. And it's a five song EP. Can we get the socials? <laughs> Oh yes, um, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter at It's Yo Yo Nosa. That is I T S Y O Y O N O S A. And for those of you that still use Facebook, go like my Facebook page at Yo Yo Nosa. And you can also stay updated with me or send me an email by visiting my website at www.itsyoyonosa.com. Thank you. Bye.